Welcome back, welcome back. We're here with a new series, and we are doing Pokemon Fire Red Rocket Edition. This is a highly requested version of the game that's been asked for me to play for probably like two years now. People have been telling me about playing this game. Uh, I got the most recent download of it, I believe. I looked it up, and this looks like the most recent download of it. Uh, update. Doesn't look like it's been done for a while. Uh, I'm excited for it. I haven't done a ROM hack in quite some time. It's been a while. And I'm not nuzlocking this. No Ironmon. I kind of described this in my prep video for this, where I'm going to kind of Ironmon it. I pretty much, like most people, just build a team and level it up. <laughs> Rattata. <laughs> Everyone gets one of your beauties for yourselves. You ungrateful little bastards to suggest you go out and steal something else. Oh my god, this is going to be great. This is a criminal organization. Oh, hi, ZZ. Every time I start recording, why do you come down here? Huh? Hey, buddy. He is the cutest. I got a Rattata. You want to come attack it? All right. It's not a charity for crying out loud. I lost this flyers. Chit chat's out of the way. How about you tell me a little about yourself, huh? That's me. What's my name? Agent Breezy reporting for duty. Agent Breezy reporting for duty. Let's see how this goes. Is that it? Yes. Well then, Breezy, a new life of violence, thievery, and other assorted misdemeanors await you. Stay away from the police, abide by your superior's orders, and never show mercy to anyone. Do this, and maybe one day you can rise to become as powerful as me. Who knows? I'll get it moving. We ain't got all day. All right. I'm excited for this. I'm excited for this. I'm like in uniform too. Look at me. If this was an R on this hat, not a Sour Patch Kid, I look like a Team Rocket member. I'm ready to go. I just took a shower, so my hair is all wet, but it's okay. It's okay. All right. Petrol. Okay, ladies, listen up. I'm only going to say this once. You're now officially Team Rocket Grunts. Yes, that's right. But don't go putting yourself, patting yourselves on the back just yet until each of you have proved yourselves out in the field. You're nothing but a bunch of pip squeaks to me. Now you're going to receive your first mission in a little bit. Before then, we have a couple things we need to get sorted. Hmm. Start from the top left here. I want you to come up one by one and get your little rodent. You will then proceed to the top floor through my staircase on the right. One of our friendly neighborhood science geeks up there will then uh, provide you with HM for a fly. Oh, right away? Our bird Pokemon, the flyer, sorry, I just, oh my god, I guess there's gonna be some swearing in this. Light swearing, I guess, but conceivably possibly and await further instruction. Okay. Understood. Yeah, sorry, which one am I? Well, then get to it. Where am I? Red hair? Is that me? Okay, next, get moving. You want the Rattata? Yeah! Pokemon does not look very energetic. I got a lazy Rattata. Would you like to give a nickname to Rattata? Yeah! I'm naming him Junior. Let's go, Junior. Breezy Junior. What else we got? Next in line, move it. Okay. Hey, you. Only one Rattata per grunt. You hear me? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ooh, we can quick walk already? Let's go, baby. And I gotta go up the staircase. Alright. Oh, oh, oh. That was an accident. That was an accident. Rocket hideout, floor one. I remember my first steal like it was yesterday. There's nothing more satisfying than stealing the, seeing the look on some poor guy's face as you brought him his lifelong companion and run away laughing. Wow. Hey, Grunt, I have a mission right about now. Quit screwing in the hideout then. You don't want to go into... Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't know where to go. You guys don't really give good instructions. All right, you're blocking that staircase. It's not that way. Is it this way? Is it you? Oh, the new recruit, is it? Yeah, I got that itch. I right here. Wait a second. All right, thank you, sir. Free fly for all grunts now, eh? Mr. Giovanni's going soft. <laughs> I'll take it, baby. You got work to do? All right. Oh, now I can go upstairs. Hey, buddy, wait up. Who are you? You're breezy, aren't you? That's right. I was right next to you in the initiation ceremony downstairs. That stuff was badass, man. Going out to steal your first Pokemon? Cool. Thanks, bud. You know, you don't strike me as the kind of guy who'd go out and decide to become a professional crook all of a sudden. You never even nicked a candy bar from the Pokemon before, am I right? <laughs> Don't worry about it, man. I'll teach you all you need to know. Thanks, bud. Hang on for just a second. Oh, you're fast. Oh, he's a fast boy. Scoo, scooting. Okay. All right, Ronnie. It just steals the Pokemon. Should we go? Let's do it. Show me how it's done. Is this like the tutorial of how to catch a Pokemon in the normal games? <laughs> I like how it's like you're in this part. That guy's watching the thing like... The Team Rocket hideout you'd expect to be and everything. This is actually kind of cool. Gonna teach others to know about stealing people's Pokemon. What's that? How am I an expert in Pokemon crime all of a sudden? Oh, look, yeah. I know I just joined Team Rocket, but I'll have you know I came prepared. Whatever you say, bud. Whatever you say. 
Pokemon Art for Dummies, Chapter 1. The first step to any successful Pokemon Ice is to pick a suitable target. Now, seeing as we're only grunts, we can only steal from kids and old people for the time being, which sucks, but hey, I'm sure we're rising up the ranks in Old Town Flat, so don't worry about it. Anyway, point being, we've got to find ourselves an old fart or give a little brat. Uh, give me a shot if you see any. Go looking. There's an old man right there. Oh, see a kid? And it's a looking schoolgirl. Six o'clock. Man, this is our big chance. Okay, okay, focus now. Let me see what the experts have to say next. Step two, engage your chosen target in a Pokemon battle and proceed to defeat them. Well, what are you waiting for? Oh, go beat the crap out of this little girl. You're the newbie here, aren't you? Yeah, I'll be right behind you, buddy. Oh, this guy's a little scaredy cat. You wanna play with me? Yay, you know, it's my favorite place in all of them. Oh my god, they make me feel so bad. I only have access to Pokemon Gaunt. My mom gave me for my birthday, but okay. Battling seems like fun. I've seen it on TV. Let's do it. Oh man, I'm about to lay the smack down. My Tad is about to put you in the dirt. You got a Pidgey. I love Pidgey. We got Tackle and Quick Attack. Okay. Oh, Rattata is so strong. Underrated Pokemon, I tell you. Very underrated Pokemon. This thing's going to be on the team for eternity. And a Spearow. Ooh, am I going to get the pick? Pidgey or Spearow. <sighs> Spearow becomes better faster. So I think I'm going to go Spearow. Uh... If, that, if that's how this is going to work, I'm assuming it's going to let me pick between one of them. Oh, that was fun. Huh? Hey, no, please. What are you doing? Let me go. Now for the final step. Now I'm mentioning with excitement. Step three. Having successfully defeated your chosen target, you may now force him or her to hand, one over, hand over one of their Pokemon as far as your rank within your organization of choice allows. Goddamn, being a gangster isn't the coolest thing in the world. <laughs> I'll hold her down. Oh, my God. Oh! No! I misclicked! <sighs> I like Pidgeotto, too. I think Pidgeotto and Pidgeot are better than Spearow and Fearow. IMO, I like them better. But, like I said, I'll probably be potentially replacing... What the heck is that? I'd probably replace this at some point, but we'll go Pidgey. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. What do we name the Pidgey? I'm gonna name him Dilly. A couple people were like, you should name a Pokemon Dilly after the incident in the last playthrough. Go check the Ultra Moon playthrough if you haven't seen, and uh, you'll understand. It was pretty straightforward, wasn't it? Ain't no thing, man. So anyway, what do you want to do now? I guess we better head over to Mount Moon like that guy Petrol talked about. That Pokemon you snacked to learn to fly, in it? Figure it out. All right, all right, all right. Okay, feel free to join me or whatever. Catch you later, man. So I gotta go back. I can teach it fly, though. Bag. TM case. A 70. Ooh, they weakened it. Fair enough. Fair enough. Pidgey's gonna be able to carry me while I fly around. Interesting. Uh, I'm gonna try not using any speed up for this too. You know what? Actually, what I'm going to do? Options. Game Boy. Uh, joypad. Configure. One. Speed. I'm gonna change it to like a random letter. So that the right trigger doesn't do the speed up anymore. So that I can't like accidentally do it. Uh, can I like grind up at all? Can I go over here? Route 7. Okay. Can I? Let's see what... Let's see what level the Pokemon are over here. I hope it's not like the same as... Oh! I, I didn't want to play a game with you, but... I feel like this guy's going to have a good team. Level 5 Poliwag. Okay. Not terrible. Bubble. Oh, gosh. I might lose this. I might lose this right now. Lowers my speed. How dare you? How dare you? Why couldn't they make fly? If they're going to lower it to 70% damage, why couldn't they just make it 100% accurate? Because I miss 90% and 95% accurate moves all the time. And it really bothers me. Goes for another bubble. I would love this experience. I would absolutely love it. Ooh, that did six damage. I do not like that. I do not like that. Crit? No. Okay, let's switch out. Going to Junior. I don't have any potions. I am not losing my first battle. 11 down to what? How much is this doing? Five damage. 
Do I have any potions? I do not. Quick attack! Oh! This needs to... Come on. Don't, don't KO. Don't KO. Ah! All right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, I think I had another Pokemon, though. Dilly level four. That's huge. Yoge gives me a level up two. All right, Junior. What does he got? A Bell Sprout. Okay, 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 okay. Bell Sprout. It's going Dilly. Come on, you got this. You got. This. We're not losing Pokemon. We're not fainting. I don't because even though I'm not locking, I don't let my Pokemon faint. I'm not about that life. I am not about that life. Vine Whip, Dodge, Fly, KO. Oh, it didn't KO. Vine Whip. Hi, Keezy. All right, click Fly again. I don't know why. I should have just clicked Tackle, but I misclicked. It's okay. Dilly with a Fly. Let's go, baby. Look at that. Master Trainer. I'm telling you, these people can't. Wait, can I take one of them? Oh, my God. I'm going to take one. Is it going to be every battle? It's, he's an old man. I can't take from him, right? Oh, I got I to pay attention. Ooh, do I want Bell Sprout or do I want... Oh my gosh, all that experience. Poliwag or Bell Sprout? Can I take one? Is that how this is going to work? <gasps> yes. Ooh. Oh, I got to do the card arts. Let me update the card arts real quick while I'm thinking about this. Let me move that aside. Uh... I am slacking here. You guys aren't even yelling at me for it. Rattata on the squad. The audio cuts out on my visual boy when I click off of it to do card arts like this. So you didn't lose audio. It's just the way my game works. Pidgey. I don't know what other Pokemon are going to become available. Um, I kind of. I think I'm going to go Bellsprout. I think I'm going to go Bellsprout. I don't know. I I figured it's nah. I'm gonna go Poliwag. I'm going Poliwag because I just thought about this. It's Team Rocket. I'm imagining you're gonna get like some Zubats or like uh. I'm assuming Zubat or like Ekans are gonna become available. If I had to guess, they're gonna become available. Poliwag. Hmm. What do we name the Poliwag? What do we do for a Poliwag? Let's name it. Let's name Larry. Larry sounds good. Let's do it. All right, we gotta go heal up. Can I use Pokemon Centers, or like, do they not allow Team Rocket in there? I'd imagine they're just gonna be, let me use them, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right, so far so good. So far so good. Okay. Um wait, can I I wanna I wanna do like some more exploring. Only little kids and old people. Only things I can steal from. Can I go this way? <coughs> oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Ooh, old man. Oh, you don't have Pokemon. Unfortunate. I'm trying to rob you. All right, I guess I'm just going to go back downstairs. <laughs> I don't want to spend too much time running around doing nothing. Okay, okay. Back down we go. He said back down to the hideout, right? I wasn't really paying attention. It's kind of not really my strong suit. You say anything? How'd your first little robbery go? Thrilling, wasn't it? Well, there's more of that came from. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What about you, bud? I think I'm willing to be a supplier for rookies on recruitment day. I mean, if I just ignore them, they'll go away on their own. Wow. That's rude. Did I come back to this dude? You? I hear you. There's gotta be something we can do to set things straight again. What's that supposed to mean, huh? Back to the base. I don't know if I'm supposed to be going this way. This is what happens when you don't read. All right, kids. Oh, is it you? Oh, about any excited mischief reason? These guys all suck, by the way. They got no gangster hustle. Do I look important to you? Basically just sit around all day looking at internet forums. I just come in in the mornings and leave when they tell me. This day's been pretty crap though. Wow. I think he said something about going to Mount Moon, but I didn't know if like... I'm supposed to be going there yet, or... I thought he said to come back here first, but... A coin case. Ooh. Already. We got the coin case. I like it. Oh, I like it. 
All right, let me see if I can fly. If I can fly right to Mount Moon, I'm going to go do that. Let's see. Pokemon. Dilly. Fly. I can. Oh, it shows the little R's on the map. That's so dope. Nice touch. Nice touch. Oh, here we go. Am I late? Hey, you over here. Listen up, Grunt. Time for your first mission. We have been informed by a well-trusted source at the Pewter City Museum that some particularly rare Pokemon fossils have been spotted inside the cave. I believe that these fossils once a car will be of great help to Team Rocket. Why? Well, that's really none of your concern, really. Now, we have hired a particular super nerd to help find and identify these fossils. He is currently making his way through the cave along with some of the other new recruits that weren't as slow in getting here as you lot. Rude. Mission today is to assist in the search any way you can. That means scavenging every nook and cranny of this hole, fending off any trainers who may have gotten a big idea about collecting some fossils on their own, and reporting any and all sightings to me. Do I make myself clear? Yeah, sure. Totally. Of course I do. Now let's get moving, kids. I got you. I got you, bud. All right. I do want to grab this item, though. Personberry. Take those. Take those. Can I go down this way? Nope. 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 Oh, they're all gone. Wow, that's kind of crazy. Mount Moon. So I don't catch Pokemon, right? Do I fight wild Pokemon? I mean, I'm sure I do, but... TM for Bullet Seed. Okay, a Moonstone. I want a Moonstone. Zubat. So can you not catch Pokemon at all? Don't have any Pokeballs. Uh, I'm not going to fight you yet. I guess I could skip that. Paralyzed Heal. Ooh, not a Moonstone. Alright, so I can't steal this guy's stuff, right? Unless, oh, you're a kid. You're a kid. Oh, bug catcher Kent, right? I would imagine this guy counts as a kid, right? He's in a kid category. Oh, Weedle or Caterpie. Ooh, do I want a Beedrill? I feel like if the Zubat option comes up, that's when I'm going to really want the poison type. Is the Zubat. But bug flying is kind of garbage. I like bug poison a lot better. Level seven. Caterpie. Yeah, I'm leveling this Pidgey up like crazy. I don't even care. Dilly dilly. Look at that. Look at you go. Such a beast. Woo! Level 8. We're popping off right now. I like it. I like it. I like it. Alright. Hey, are you one of them? Yeah. Give me your Pokemon. Haha. -ha. I'm gonna go Weedle. I'm gonna go Weedle. At least the ability to like poison thing something is pretty clutch early on. Give a nickname to the stolen Weedle. Yes, yes, yes. Let me add Weedle to the card art. Bam. 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 What do we name the Weedle? Um I will be taking nickname suggestions from you guys as well. Uh but for this playthrough, it's gonna be more or less just like a me kind of think. I don't know. I'll probably still look through comments for suggestions and stuff, but I didn't do that for the first episode, so I'm going to do my own. Um, hmm. Email Weedle. Do I have a nickname for like a Beedrill? I don't think I do. I did Larry. Let's do Sally. We'll do Sally and Larry. I don't know why. Just random. Per usual, it's how I work. As random as possible. Just come look at the fossils too. Yep. That's why I'm here. 100%. Oh, man, that sneeze. I've been sneezing a lot today. And it's been turning me into a sniffle McGee. Can I go Clefairy or Jigg Jigglypuff? I'll be so happy. I'll be so happy. I will take a Jigglypuff all day. Mm. Come on. Encored me into fly, but I'm infatuated with you. Let's go, Junior. Let's go, Junior. Hound. Ow. Go for a tail whip. It's six damage, so I can take two more. Encored. I got outplayed, boys and girls. I'll go for one more. Lower that defense. Go for growl. That's fine. I'm going to switch around. Because I want the experience. 
on my other guys. I wonder if fairy typing's in here. I wonder. Go for bubble. Oof. It's doing no damage. No damage. Sally, what do you got for moves? You have shield dust. You have, you have poison sting. Perfect. We'll find out right now if error types in the game. Ugh, my nose is so runny. Growl, I don't even care about that. I just want to see if this is super effective or not. Let's see. It is. Let's go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, that did some damage. That did a lot of damage. Excuse me, Clefairy. All right, everyone got experience in this one, so this is going to be good. This will be good. Level 9 already. I feel like the levels are jumping up pretty quickly. Wait, do you have two Pokemon? Do you have the Jigglypuff? You do not. Can I steal this? No, I don't think I can steal from a lass. No, can't. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Heal up real quick. Oh, this guy's selling Magikarp, so he sold one to me? A lot of flying types. I have no money. <laughs> I have no money. Okay. Okay. Let's try to continue through this a little bit then. Uh, who do I want to level up more? I can't level up Junior a little bit. I also I feel like Larry would probably be better to level up. Let's let's try to do that. Let's try to get Larry level up a little bit. We are going to... Guys, over here, I think I found something. What? It came from down here. Better check it out. Sure thing. What's going on, pals? Where'd you go, friends? Oh. Hmm. Level 2 Paris. That's going to give no experience. Not even worth. Not even worth. Am I getting promoted now or what? What is it? Rarest looking false you've ever seen? Oh, gosh. It's a freaking Moonstone, for crying out loud. To evolve censored little Pokemon like Jigglypuff? Ah. I'm... I'm confused. I don't know what was censored about that, but I'll take the Moonstone. I'll gladly take the Moonstone. What we got down here? More Zubat. Uh, can I want to be one of Zubat? Are you going to just supersonic me and make me annoyed? I feel like you're going to. feel like you're going to. Oh, decent damage. Leech life. Is that going to be strong? Or is it going to be super weak like it should be? <laughs> super weak. All right. Cool. We can 1v1 this. We can 1v1 this. This will give some good experience. I wonder what are the Pokemon. I'm going to get the pick from. Think, think in Moonstone, I'm immediately thinking between Nidoran, male and female. I would imagine that will come up, but I don't know for sure. Um, Growlithe, Vulpix, maybe. Really? Double Supersonic? Come on, Zubat. Come on. That's what we're doing. Yeah, that ain't gonna work on me. I'm already confused. Still confused. Come on, Junior. You got this. I was gonna say you never get confused. You never hit yourself in confusion. You're too smart. Too smart. What other kind of combos could it be? Uh Volpix Growl if I could see. Um Kabuto, Ama Knight. I'm sure you'll probably have to pick through those at some point. It is cool that you get a, you kinda get to pick like through those though. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That was no experience. Oh, that's sad. Oh, that is sad. That was so little experience. Let me fight some Geo dudes or something. That's what I want to do. Going up here. Ronnie, there you are, Breezy. Dude, you better get over here. Everybody's all in a frenzy about some strong-ass trainer that came in here just now. I just got here, so I haven't have a clue what happened, but it sounded pretty darn exciting. <laughs> all right. I'm telling you, he beat me straight out without even breaking a sweat. It's like I barely got a chance to even make a move before he's off in my face. The man, I give him prize money. Tell me about this spiky-haired kid was ruthless, man. Everything came from... Oh, Gary? <laughs> Sounds like Gary. 
uber powerful Pokemon, some irresponsible parent right there, if you ask me. <laughs> I like how they're judging. <laughs> By some kid? Who thought you out of battle, huh? Your mom's? A real prodigy. I'm gonna hit the Pokemon Center for a while. Can't find any damn fossils around here anyway. Roger that. I need to do some grinding. Or if I fight Gary. Spiky haired rich kid. Sounds like him. Talk about a bunch of wussies. You know, scared of some little kid trainer here. No! Come on, Spiky a little twerps. Alright, alright. Alright. You gonna go that way? I'm looking this way. Yeah, items. Items. Don't sneak up on you. Oh, you were looking at me the whole time. What are you talking about? And then one Pokemon. A Voltorb. Ooh. Level 7. I'm not healed up. This could be a problem. I'm going to click Bubble. Because I was going to say. He has like Thunder Shock. I should be able to live one anyway. Not great damage. Charge. Ooh, that's annoying. Raises your special defense. I was going to say, I was like, I don't know if they adjusted how it worked in this game. It didn't always raise your special defense. I think it used to... Um, oof, I think it only raised your next attack. The next electric attack would do more damage. I think that's all it used to do. Let's try to get this poison on this guy. That'd be clutch. Come on, Weedle. I believe in you, Sally. Come on. Keep clicking charge. I'm all for it. That'll be free experience. The freest of experiences. This is reminding me, of, like, the last ROM hack I feel like I really played through that was similar to this was the Dragon Ball Z version of this, which the playthrough of it I have is on my YouTube. Um, I don't think that game's been adjusted or touched since it was done, like, five years ago. So, and the game was a little unfortunate. I mean, it was, it was a good idea and everything, but the typings and stuff, like, made no sense. It was like everything was a fighting type. It was like no super effective attacks against anything. And it was pretty much you just clicked like Dragon Dance and Kamehameha over and over again. That's like pretty much all it was. It wasn't really much strategy into it. It was just like get your Goku and Vegito, whatever, and just Dragon Dance up pretty much whatever they called it, like Kaioken. And you just do that a bunch of times. And that's all it really was. So it was a cool game. The art and stuff was cool. Fighting like certain trainers and stuff. Well, it was a cool vibe and everything, but. It's not a game I think I would play through again. Another bug catcher, but I need to go heal up. My team is my team is hurting right now. My team is hurting right now. <gasps> Geo dude. Geo dude. Bubble. Let's go, Larry. Get that free experience, baby. The freest experience. Send me more of those. Send them all my way. That's actually a really good experience. I almost leveled up. I will take that. All right. We're going to heal up here. And I'm going to save it here as well. We're almost at the 30 minute mark. Uh, so I'm going to wrap it up here. And in the next episode, we'll continue through. It looked like there was another bug fighter guy over there. So I could fight him and probably take a Pokemon from him. Curious to see what that'll be. And leave some nicknames. Because like I said, for these first call Pokemon, I didn't you know, take any nickname suggestions. But I am open to them. And let me know if you guys are excited for this playthrough. Uh, it's going to be different, a different kind of vibe, but I think it'll be exciting. And I'm always going to go back to Nuzlocke's and stuff in the future. So I just want to switch it up for a bit. So leave a like and a comment and I will see you in the next one. All right. Peace out.